process was there when you say process did you, were you was there a time when you felt shame about talking about it it's I, not shame mm -hmm. inadequacy mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. explain that i felt inadequate as a woman yeah yeah because if the, the message you didn't get in from as a woman i felt yeah. inadequate so if guys welcome to my channel good morning good afternoon good evening depending on where you're watching this very video from please make sure you subscribe like and also share so today we're talking about asm yes i will drop the rest of the video immediately i'm done with what i have to say so we're talking about actress asm she recently had an interview with children where she expressed how she felt upon realizing she cannot have her own kid kids as a woman well, it's so touching. So, you know, this woman, I love her so much. I love the way she acts. I love the way she carries herself. I just love everything about her. But I know many people also like her. But, well, we don't know what, you know, how it means for a woman to have her own children. Um, realizing that she will not be able to have her own children because of one illness or the other well Trudy asked her how does she feel or does she, does she feel ashamed as a woman that she cannot be able to bear her own children and her response well her response is her response her response was she's according to her she said that she didn't feel ashamed but inadequate she said she felt inadequate as a woman because every time it was mentioned that it was mentioned that she wouldn't be able to have her own kids, that she would remember. So that was what it was for her. She's not ashamed that she, she wouldn't be able to have her own children, but that she felt inadequate. Them, I get it. Feeling inadequate. That she won't be able to have her own children. It's something else. Something so she she will undergo an a surgery where a uterus that's a womb was removed. And you know once a woman's uterus is removed, that it is bye bye to childbearing. If the person did not, not the person did not have a child before. But she did it in order to save her life. Yes, in order for her to be alive today. She didn't do she didn't do it because she wanted she did it because of her medical condition and all through she said her husband have been supportive her husband have have uh, have been with her stood with her but I don't know I think she's divorced now so guys I don't know I'm gonna leave the the remaining video so that you guys will also watch I don't want to waste too much of your time. So please do not forget to subscribe and like. Nigeria is a country defined by shame. You know, shame collides everywhere. Shame that you've not found the husband. Shame that you are divorced. Shame, shame that, that you can't get a miracle. Get a, <laughs> shame that you pray that you didn't get a miracle. Shame that you shared your testimony and then you are going to go back and see the testimony was. It's shame everywhere. And <laughs> it's shame. That it's, it's shame. It's an so you cannot shame me, shame me. <laughs> Yes. So, so there was no overthinking when you talked about this. There was no process. Was there? When you say process, did you? Were you was there a time when you felt shame about talking about it? It's I, not shame. Mm -hmm. Inadequacy. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Explain that. I felt inadequate as a woman. Yeah. Yeah. Because. If the, the message you're even getting it from as a woman, I felt yeah. inadequate. So every time it was my, should I would remember, mm. you know. So it just it's, that happens what it was. But shame, mm. I'm not ashamed. <laughs> <laughs> Man, uh, mm -mm. Yeah. So it's the least that I would be. I shame. I I don't. I don't. I, I can't. And I'm thankful for how I was brought up. We, we don't tie shame to, mm. to ourselves. Mm -hmm. We live through life. life. Fully. Fully. Yeah. And I 
that's how it is. Um, I mean, I'm taking it for granted that your husband has stood by you throughout all of that. <laughs> exactly. No. It's just that it's that it's that not the way it's supposed to be. Because yes. when yes. people say, "Oh, we need to really be thankful for," no, there's nothing. Yeah, I don't. I, yeah. I don't say, no, 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 no. No. So, like, what happened? What really happened? <laughs> this is is what is, is, is us. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. You walk in there as it, as it's a partnership. What comes, good, bad, yes. ugly. It's That's us. What it is. Just let it be. Yeah. Yeah. But you, you hide your husband more than Coca Cola hides whatever it is they put inside the bottle. He's not hiding. He's yeah. a really private person. Right. Mm. <laughs> oh, I love that. <laughs> zoom in, zoom in, zoom in. <laughs> What's his name now? Tom. Tom Hanks moment. Tom. Give it to me. Give it to me. No, it's not Tom Hanks. It's the okay. other one. Um, who did Who did Mission Impossible? Tom Hanks. Is this That's the one on Oprah's couch. Okay, I'm okay. okay. <laughs> <laughs> no, having it. Tom Cruise. Tom Cruise. Sorry, you're right. Yeah, hey, you're right. Yeah, yeah, see me, see me. Tom Cruise. Sorry. Tom Cruise. I am the actor. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's a Tom yeah, Cruise moment. Yeah, yes, yeah. Tom Hanks did Castaway. Yeah.